I for one, Dester, back with Corpse Party. Okay, last time I managed to save um, Naomi uh, when she tried to kill herself. Um, uh, she's resting now, and I need to find. Um, how do you call her again? Yuka! So I have to find a way to go outside to manage to find Yuka. But I have a bad feeling, so I must part ways from Naomi. The walkway was just at the bottom of these stairs to the right. Is it still gonna be there though? Nope. Seems like it's not there. It's not here? Well, what do I do then? Uh oh. Why? Why is there a wall here? There was a whole other building. What the hell is going on? Aww. I swear if Yuka dies, I'm gonna be so upset. Why must you torment me like this? I have a bad feeling about this. What's that? What is that? Uh oh. The, si the sign said elementary school students couldn't buy them without, without a parent's permission. But they sold me a hamster anyway, and it was only 450 yen. Heh, <laughs> didn't I tell you? Their lives aren't worth much at all. Kizumi is a psycho. What? Oh, nothing. I don't trust this guy. So, what are we gonna do with it? Heh, <laughs> look at how cute it is. You wanna take care of him? Hey, you're kidding, right? That smelly thing? Hey, hamsters can be cute. Huh? So what then? Something really special. Wait, to wait, you'll, uh, wait till you see it. The end of a life, the very moment of death. Come on, give it here. What? He is insane. This box cutter should do the trick, huh? No. Don't kill the hamster. What? what? Are you stupid? Why would you do that? Watch closely now. You're... No, I don't want to hear that! Don't kill the hamster! What do you think you're doing? It, it's because I'm a sister. Nothing. Why are you using a Stanley mask? Don't you, don't you nothing me, you little asshole? You've got a knife and an animal in your hands. Yeah, but I didn't do anything yet, so I'm not... Are you for real? You realize that no one likes a smartass, right? You'd better call that Sesmas if you're a grow- uh, I need to stop pressing enter eventually. Uh, Kizumi, give him here. I'll take care of the little th guy myself, okay? Okay, see you tomorrow. Don't kill the hamster. Oh, Don't kill the hamster! <sighs> I swear, I don't know how he can put up with you. Don't kill the hamster! Just shut the fuck up already. Why did I have to be the youngest anyway? Wait, you're the youngest? If I had a little brother of my own... I'd love, <laughs> I'd love the shit out of him. I sure as hell wouldn't be like in my goddamned holier... Holier than thou sister or my fucking retard of a brother. I'd listen to the little tyke and respect him. Here, I'm not pressing enter. It's just doing that. And if I had a little sister on my own, haha, <laughs> uh oh. Oh crap. Don't kill Yuka, I swear to god. Uh oh. No, don't kill Yuka, please. Don't do it. I swear if you kill Yuka. I swear to god. What's the matter, Yuka? They're all full. Hmm? What? Second win, girls the four to- Oh my god. <laughs> what the hell? Who did this? Or did they do it themselves? Holy crap. The body inside is too near the stall door. Every time you try to open it, it just slams into the corpse and bounces closed. That's quite a stench. There must be- Oh my god. There's a student ID name tag on the floor outside. Oh my god. Oh, I got another student ID. Oh my god. Holy crap, that's creepy. Uh, let me read the victims. I got new victims, right? Uh, starved to death while searching for a friend. Attempted to drink own blood. Bled to death. 
drank contaminated water, died vomiting. Oh my god, that's cruel. Hanged by unknown asylum. Attacked from behind while searching for friends. But there was another one that got hanged, right? I guess. Holy crap, that's sinister. I can't leave? What? You're going back in? A great many lives ended in this room. What? <laughs> oh, I have a bad feeling. Oh, you're finally losing it after you killed a guy. You're still losing it. Uh oh. Uh, oh, I swear if you kill Yuka. Oh no no no! Don't kill Yuka! I swear to God, if you kill Yuka, don't do it. Don't test me, man. No, don't kill Yuka, please, please, I beg you. Poor little Yuka, with all these bodies in here, you'll never be able to relieve herself. Don't do it, man. <sighs> Don't do it, I swear I don't want Yuka to die. Well then. No, Yuka, don't do it. Shall we be off? You said you protect her, right? My dear little sister. Oh my god, he's going insane. <sighs> he's going insane. Don't do it, I don't want Yuka to die, I swear. Who am I now? Who's this? Ayumi! Sure is cool. Where did Miss Mishido and Kishinu Numa go anyway? Oh yeah, I forgot she didn't die. Don't leave him by myself, I'm scared, you know. Well, you wandered off! I got this guy kidnapped, Yoshiki. Maybe I should try going back to room 1A. If I stay in this other school building for too long, my head's really going to start pounding. Well... I guess there's no other choice. What if I do go- oh, never mind. I can't even go back. Really wonder what ha would happen if I, um... If I do the thing where Naomi died. Uh-oh. I will try that later, though, because I want to try to get all the bad endings, too. Can't be there's no bad ending with Naomi dying, so... I will try that later. Uh-oh. Hi, you're the fourth girl, aren't you? With the red dress. Oh, you're creepy. No, no more. Red dress? Her photo was in an article, so I guess she's one of the victims. Wait. I'm so confused. Treat tomorrow like a certainty. If you're alive now, trust that you'll still be alive then. If I recall, it's the Tash Shibiana's turn for a day duty tomorrow. I want to go back to class. I hate the idea that I might not be able to ever again. I swear I'll take my schoolwork more seriously from now on. What happens if I go back? Will I find more name tags? I kind of do want to know. Judging besides, he appears to be in the rain. Okay. Seiko Tanaka. I kind of do want to go back. Oh. Yeah, it's really heavy. It makes my ears ring. Okay. Best head back to 1A before going any further. Just to check in. Well. Oh. Oh, I was about to say, it seems like I have no other choice, but I kind of don't want to yet. <sighs> oh, hi. What's up with you? Whether you're facing a flyer on the wall or just standing in the middle of the room, if you think there's something nearby, press the examine key. Never give up. Okay. Oh, what? Whoever this is seems to only have just died mere hours, minutes, or even moments ago. Yuma Misaki. There's an old crumbled up piece of paper next to the body. Well, Yuma, I guess this is as far as you go. Exhaustion has set in, so it looks like it's the end of the world. My classmate Tomo Mizuki climbed, his fence, climbed the fence around the outdoor walkway and slipped into the woods outside school. It's been three days now and she still hasn't come back. All the while, I've been stuck here getting chased around by the ghost of a girl with nothing above her jawline. With the headless girl. And I've not only twisted my ankle, but also got glass cuts all over my wrist, so I'm in no condition to keep running. I keep hearing the snip 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 sound of scissors everywhere I go. I can't tell if it's real or it's just a ringing in my ears. I wish I'd just die already, get it over with so I can finally rest. Maybe I can have my head cut off at the jaw like that bit. Oh, 
Wow. Okay then. Oh, hi. You're an evil spirit. It hurts so much. Even in death, it still hurts. Now and always. Can I get past you? Yeah, I can. I don't trust this hallway. For one second, you know that? Okay. Um, is there more stuff here? No, there doesn't seem to be any stuff here. Besides the static noise. <sighs> okay, let's... There's nothing here for now. Wasn't there, like... A classroom here, or is this a different floor? I have no idea. All I know is that I don't like it. Okay, um... Oh, this fell over. Uh... Okay, I can't get past this, but that one guy certainly can if I get to play as him again. Okay, let's go back down for now. I don't trust this, though. I don't know, I constantly am nervous that a ghost is gonna pop up for some reason. Okay, let's go to the left. Before I go the other hallway. Okay, congratulations on your arrival. Our most heartfelt blessings we offer today. We'll be anxiously waiting for your death. And once everyone's dead, that's when we'll all be able to meet again. And then the conquest begins. Okay, that's totally not weird. That's normal. Oh, hi! It's the body of a middle school door, wherever it was since... Uh, okay... I keep finding name tags, though. There's a candle that I lit. Okay, uh, let's save on fall 2. Fall 1 is the one with Naomi being... Wait. Is Naomi dead in this one or not? In this save fall? I have no idea. I don't remember if the save 1 was with Naomi being dead or save 3. I think save 1. But I'm not sure. Okay, before I go in the classroom... What? Ow! Did you really just fall in glass? And Yumi's hands landed squarely in the middle of a sea of broken glass from a fall of light fixture. Really? The skin between the index finger and thumb on her right hand was cut wide open. <laughs> Ow! It's bleeding pretty badly. I hope the hand chief can stop it. Just found out I'm anemic yesterday too. Great timing, huh? What's that? That you don't stop bleeding or something? Starting to get dizzy now. Not good. I need to sit down or something. Uh oh. This can't be good for anyone. Oh god. It's not like you're going to be rescued after all. We already tried everything we could, could we could to get out. We have exhausted every possibility. You might live another few days, maybe even a week or two, if you tough it out. But you can't stand to live that long with nothing to eat, nothing to drink, no change of clothes. Dying is just a whole lot easier. So come on, join us. We're all waiting for you. It might even be fun. There are so many ways to die. Just imagine the possibilities. But don't tarry. We're waiting after all. Waiting to welcome you. <sighs> Shut up! Shut up! I swear, if I'm gonna read more of those, I swear I'm gonna go insane. I need to find... Oh, there's a whole lot of blood here. The shelves, uh, turn your book. One... Is sticking out farther than the others as it's begging to be soon. Why do I feel like if I pull it out, it, this is gonna fall on top of me? The cardinal directions are to be laid flat upon a clock face with additional devices placed amongst them to mimic fully times 12 much. Beginning with the red affix. Is this a hint? Red affix at due north. The 12 signs of the chi Chinese zodiac will be. Blah blah blah. Red ox, tiger, rabbit, dragon, snake, horse, ram, monkey, rooster, dog, pig. Then back to red. For ease of resemblance, it's best to. Blah, blah. Uh, North then is both red and 12 o'clock. East is the rabbit and east by the side is the dragon. This is the base. I swear if this is a hint. I'm too lazy to read that now. Okay. Can this be opened? Nope. I'm afraid to save because I cut myself. I'll just save on fall one. I only spent five minutes in there. Anyway, so if I want to get a bad ending where Naomi dies, I can just always <laughs> go real back real quick and get her to kill herself. That sounds so morbid. Not joking about suicide, just wanna point that out. I'm not. Don't do it. Okay, this is where Yui fell down. I haven't found Miss Yui ever since. Chapter 2. Wonder if she's gonna be okay. Okay, let's go up for now. I know I need to go to red room 1, but I wanna explore a bit more. Before I do that. I wanna find all the name tags, actually. Oh, I can't even go up there anymore. It's blocked off. I remember being a... Uh, room up there that Yoshiki and I can go in 
Since chapter 2, I wonder if I'm ever gonna be able to get to there. Let's just go to the classroom then. Okay, I'm here now. The message you wrote previously is still clearly visible on the teacher's desk. No one's responded yet. I wonder if, if anyone's even see it. My message. Wasn't that Yoshiki's message? Okay, but no one is in here. There's a torn note there. Was that note there before? I don't think it was. Let's try to read it. Unless it's like a note that changes directions and places the whole time. I hope not. Okay, it doesn't. There is a note here though. There's a scrambled up note on the floor. There's one thing I've learned from all of this. The children are victim too. The children are victims too. They're not at fault here. They may they're not the ones we should hate. Their murderer is the one who created the cycle of resentment and cruelty. Their murderer is our, our true enemy. Well, what does that do for me? She said I needed to sit down, right? But... I don't know, there's nothing in there. Should I go to the infirmary? Maybe I can meet up with... Uh, uh oh. Now there are two bodies here. There are two corpses here, both large enough to deduce that they were probably high schoolers. It appears they died hand in hand and their bleached white bones are still holding hands even now. Damn. But one got faster dead. Oh. I'm so glad we could find each other before we died. We'll set, off, we set, we'll set off on this journey together, holding hands forevermore. There's nothing to be scared of as long as we have each other. We know there was meaning in our lives because we were fortunate enough to find our soulmates. To find one another among all the fish in the sea. To our mothers and our fathers, take heart. We died happy and wanted for nothing. And now we finally pass over to the other side. Our hunger pains will be gone. We'll fly up to heaven and be joyous forevermore. Our only regret is the pain our deaths will cause you. But one day we'll meet up again in the golden realm of the ever after. Oh, that's so sad. There's a sheet. Um, idiots, there's no getting into heaven from here. But one is all corrupted and one is not. Never stuck at one budge. There does seem to be space for it to go down one more notch. But the mecha mechanism is locked. There's a tiny per per peculiarly shaped key in its... Okay, so I need to find a key for that. Wait, maybe if I go to the inferno I can meet up with Satoshi and can get that shiny thing in the one um, room? I don't know. Nothing is here, so let me try to go to the infirmary. Do I have any items? Nope, I do not. <sighs> Let's try to get to the infirmary. Okay, might as well just save and fall on. Okay. I'm a spastic saver. I save on every fall differently. Uh, at least the music is not as sinister as in chapter 2, because holy hot damn. Can I even get to the infirmary is the question. Hi, you're still there. Okay, I think I can. If this is the correct way, I should be able to, right? I hope so. Yeah, if I go down here. Wait, there was a corpse here before, right? I wonder if I... But I'm not in the same space as Satoshi, am I? Uh, that's the bloody door. What will happen? Oh, I found it. Oh, great. There's nothing here. And Tick Doll you threw down earlier is still lying here. Pick it up. Yeah, sure. Pick it up. Okay. Why were you crying? There's a torn piece of newspaper on the ground. Looks like top of my head. Read it. Sure. Uh, the light and dark side of Heavenly Host Elementary Principal Ta Takamine Yanigaori. The ground was broken for 10 years. Uh, Heavenly Host and Run Building. It quickly became a source of pride for the town, as no elementary school had stood within blah blah blah. Primary schools had previously been blah 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 blah. Sorry, I, it's, it's, I, I can't pronounce properly. Um, yep, the Yanagori quickly became popular among the locals for his personality, his work ethic, and his firm. Rather than for attendance, scored well beyond the school capacity, and uh, Chris, uh, yeah. Essentially, due to unwavering dedication, have Leo's became concerned. Uh, but all that began to change on the dawn of one fateful day with an accident that would set the stage of Hamlio's rapid fall from grace. Blah 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 blah. 
Newspaper and the rest is missing. Okay, let me save just to make sure. I, what? Hmm? What's my candle doing here? <coughs> I'm sure I left it outside in the hallway. Did someone move it? Uh. Oh yeah, I remember. Okay, what if I... Wait, can I actually go to the... Wait, hold up. What if I lay on the bed? Can I? There's a spirit here. Uh-oh. Back away slowly. No, I'm going straight to you. Hi. <laughs> He's staring right at... Yeah, I'm gonna get myself killed. Bad ending incoming! The dead black arrows of the boy spirit left eye transfixes a human's gaze. It begins slowly expanding in size. Ugh. Uh, I can't. Uh oh, sorry. I <laughs> move my body. The boy Iris continues to grow slowly and methodically, enveloping Yumi until only blackness remains. The world vanishes into nothingness at the, as the soulless m muscle becomes an elk, uh, blotting out the whole of existence. Suddenly, in the distance, a tiny white face breaks through the darkness, shining with its own unnatural light. No, no, please, please, no, I'm so scared, please. The face seems distorted, as if viewed through water. Its expression shifts and wobbles for a bit until finally, with some effort, the Im image clears. You've seen this face before. Oh, Somebody please help! Poor Yumi. Killed her off like that. Well, there you got a wrong ending. I think. Pretty sure. Welp. I killed her off like that. I'm sorry. Yay, not a wrong ending. <laughs> sorry, I just wanted to see all the wrong endings, man. Why not? And if you want to see all the wrong endings, I don't know, go search up a guide or something if this isn't fast enough for you. But I just want to try, wanna try to get all the wrong endings for myself. I want to see if I can do it. Which wrong ending was it though? Wait, it didn't. S it said wrong end, but it didn't say which wrong end. Oh, I guess I got the second wrong end. It didn't say actually which wrong ending this time. So normally it said like wrong end, one out of four, two out of four, four out of four, three out of four. Okay, let me try that again. This time without looking at him. Okay, if I go over here, hi. And I'm just gonna back away slowly. And I'm gonna leave you be. And you're not gonna follow me and kill me, right? I hope not. Don't follow me, please. Oh no, you're gonna follow me. I can't go this way. I can't bring myself to see Susan Moto like that again. I feel like I lose my mind. Oh, come on! <sighs> okay, I guess I really can go another way. Now where do I go? I can go to the right either, because the, the the thick air is making you go dizzy. <sighs> uh -oh. Where's this coming from? Sounds muffled like one of those toy Mika doll of telephones, but it's definitely close. It's the damn doll, it's making noises again. Do I follow it? I can go over here. Okay, uh, well, but I did, there was nothing there. Okay, what if I follow the do doll's noise? Oh no, you're not gonna make any noise. Oh, I was about to say. Let me have back then. Again. But the doll. Uh. I don't know. I'll head back again then. I guess. But there's nothing there, really, is there? It probably isn't a key either, so. Okay, I'll save again. Why not? I'm a spastic saver, you know that. Okay. I really need to try something. I At least I got one bad ending already. I guess one has to do something with Naomi. But I don't know. 
Okay, let's head back to 1A. There's still probably no one there. This is 1A, so what do you want from me? Nothing new is added, so... What do you want from me, one? There's thrown paper again. Okay, I guess I'll just have to follow the doll's noise then. I don't hear it, so maybe I have to go back to that one press point and go up? I don't know. I can't get to the bathrooms because that's where Mayo is. Okay. Ugh. Oh, there you go again. Okay, it's definitely in this area. Then I guess I have to go upstairs. Or just up. Or something, because that really is my- Oh, or down maybe. Down here? Oh, that's creepy. Hi, is there anything here? I don't like that it's so dark, you know? There doesn't seem to be anything here. Okay, I guess I'll just have to go up then. Okay, I guess this is literally the only path I can take. Uh oh. What is giggling? Oh my god, I don't like this. Okay. I'm definitely getting close because I hear the giggles and... Hi. Oh, you say the same? Yep, you say the same. What if I go to the right? Because that's where I found part of the doll. Before. Wasn't there a body before? There's blood traces now. And it's still close, right? Yup. I guess I have to go to the left then. I don't know. I have a bad feeling about this again. Okay, let's just go up for now. And then to the left. Maybe there's something here. Nope. There isn't something either. And I can't move this, so... Hmm. I really wonder what it wants for me. I have this doll. Huh. I don't know where it wants me to go, actually. You say the same, right? Um, or just standing in the middle of the room. Okay, maybe here somewhere? Middle of the room, right? Nope, there doesn't seem to be anything here either. Oh, what? Though the floor that there had been collapsed previously, the gap seems to be mysteriously closed upon its own. It feels completely solid. Oh. I thought I was close to getting a clue, but... I'm just pressing enter everywhere, but it doesn't seem to work, so I'll have to figure this out later. Because... There... I probably have to go somewhere here, but I don't know exactly where, so... Hmm... Middle of the room, too, right? And I can't go to the right, so... I have to figure it out, so I'll end it short here. So, this was Test with Corp Party. Thanks everyone for watching, I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Hey guys, if you like this video and want to see more, it would be great if you could support me on Patreon. Even $1 helps me out already if enough people do it. Thanks in advance!